Hey, hello, gun aficionados and gun enthusiasts. Today we're looking at a very rare bird. This is a very rare Smith & Wesson 44 Special aluminum alloy frame titanium cylinder. This is interesting. It shows you there on the barrel of maximum bullet 200 grain. I wish they would do that on all of them. Wouldn't that be cool? They stamped that inside. 44 Smith & Wesson special cartridge. And it is, drum roll, it's an Airlite TI. This is an aluminum alloy frame. Not to be confused with the Smith & Wesson model 329 PD 44 Magnum, four inch frame. This is three and one eighths, has the uh, steel inner sleeve. No lock, isn't that nice? 44 special, five shots. This is a L frame. So uh, you can put the K frame grips on there. And as you can see in there, it says 396. Very, very light. This gun weighs 18 ounces. Again, it's a 3 and 1 8 inch barrel. This is interesting. It has a lanyard loop. So you can tie it to your belt so you don't lose it. Very tight, been fired very little, very tight. It's nice and loose here, like butter. Locks up nice. It's got the mem hammer and trigger. Firing pin is in the frame. Got a, uh, it's got a smooth trigger. I like the smooth trigger. And this thing is really light. Great action. Let's see how she stages. Locked. Pretty heavy trigger. I haven't cleaned it yet, so it's kind of dirty in there. Just picked her up today. She's dirty. Needs a bath. I'll get her cleaned up. So anyway, it's five shot L frame. You can see where it's been, uh, you know, the flame hits it there like a blowtorch. And my J frame scanning, and they put a little piece of stainless steel in there. Huh, they didn't do it on this one. I wonder why. Anyway, I guess you can add that if you want to. But yeah, it's got a pretty heavy trigger, but the gun itself is so light. Got these whole grips, which are nice and comfy. Back is exposed. And let's see how the uh, foot grips are gonna look on here. Let me put these on here and see how they look.
There you go. Nice wood grips. They're not Smith and Wesson, but you know, they're light, comfortable, very, very comfy. Covers the back strap, so you have a little bit more. Feels your hand a little, little bit more than the, the smaller. So these are Bantam. They're by Hogue. And to get them on and off, you need this special little wedge. What you do is you, you push it here next to the pin. When you push it in, it spreads it out. And you could get it off that pin. It's pretty easy once you get the hang of it. Here she is, my latest toy, 44 Special, five shot L frame. It's got a fiber optic sight, which you can change out. Just punch out that little pin. You could put Trijicon in there or the gold dot, whatever you like. Hi Viz. Okay, this is a mountain light. And here it says air light. It's got the little Shedson logo there. <laughs> this comes in a uh, silver metal case. That's a cool gun, very rare. You don't see very many of these. You see the, the 44 Magnums. Why would anyone want to shoot a 44 Magnum with an air light frame? This is a 44 Special. 44 Special is about equivalent to a 45 ACP. So it's not that bad. But it's really light, easy to carry. You know, and you got a man, you got, you got some power there. 44 special, that's a big ass round. Very nice, I like it. Smith & Wesson, 44 Special, Air Light, Mountain Light, have a light, it's on me. So there it is, 44 Special, take care of your guns, they'll take care of you. Mm -hmm.